bulk and drying systems, one ton portable thermal absorption unit. Units fed by a twin screw center discharge live bottom feeder with Grizzly hopper. Grizzly hopper feeds an incline 30 foot screw conveyor. Flow is metered by twin knife gates to minimize introduction of oxygen into the system. Twenty-seven feet long, three feet diameter stainless steel rotary dryer. Each end has bellow seals, brass on steel. They're pneumatically controlled with one-way cylinders. Material discharge is also through double pneumatically operated knife gates with high temp seals, 20 foot discharge screw conveyor, control panel with breakers overloads, variable frequency drives, Siemens burner controllers, PLC controls, HMI and temp controllers readings. Redundant fuel pumps for the fuel supply. Primary combustion blower. Better view of the feed. Air locks and hopper. Side view of the burners. The kiln is lined with interwoven kiln chains to aid in the drying and cleaning process. And it's noisy here inside. Three stacks, one for each of the three zones. Auxiliary panels with spark generators. As the water and hydrocarbons are vaporized, they're pulled through this ductwork to, first of all, an oil spray scrubber. It has redundant oil pumps. Second stage water scrubber.
air cooled heat exchanger as the vapor exits the second stage scrubber let's pull through this crossover duct to the ID fan which feeds this thermal oxidizer protected by redundant flame arresters discharge stack with oxygen analyzer combustion air blower oxidizer burner and at the rear of the trailer is the oil water separator for transportation purposes the live bottom feeder will set alongside this